Deftones, Knife Party, Seven String Method, Guitar Tabs, and Guitar Lesson. Okay, so we'll just be hanging out in this standard uh, seven string here. Uh, so we got the B, all right, and then we just start with our six string, the E, A, D, G, B, E. All right, and uh, it, it works pretty well for this tuning here. Um, kind of some stretchy stuff going on, so uh, if you're not down with that, then maybe you just need to work on this a little bit. But this initial chord, this E flat major seven sus two, you know, fun chord here. Uh, we can grab that here pretty nicely. Um, interesting shape where we go. Uh, basically a power chord at the fourth fret of the low B here. We got the six on the E. Okay, and we'll just kind of mute the the A. Um, I guess if you're really slick, you could use your available ring finger and just hit the five on the A if you wanted but not necessary. Uh, you can just keep it muted. Um, and then behind it here, we need to get the threes on the D, G, and B string. Okay, so we got the. All right, and you wanna try not to hit that high E. It'd be a little tricky there. All right, and basically the strum on this, we just do one, one, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, four, five, one, two. It's a real interesting kind of strum here. All right. All right, and we're gonna crank through that twice. All right, and after that, we're gonna zoom up to our next spot, which is basically just going between a G sus two to a G minor, and then back to G sus two. And I'd say the uh, best way to do that, you zoom up here so the frets get a little closer, makes it a little easier. And um, we come up to eight on the B, okay, 10 on the E, and a 12, all right? It's that kind of classic sus two shape there. All right, and with this, we just kind of do like the same strum, all right? One, one, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, four, five, one, two. All right, and then the back half of it, we just change that 12 on the A there up to a 13. So it's probably the biggest stretch we got here. And if that's too much for you, um, you can just kind of stay here and then just use the eight on the, the D string here. Just, it'd be the same. Okay, it's that 13 on the A. Uh, I like to just stretch and grab the 13. Um, so what we would do is just do the, the 8, 10, 13. All right, and then just strum on it four times. And then we just come back to the 12, 1, 1, 2, 3, 4. For the verse section here, uh, pretty much the same chords. We just come in with a new dynamic and uh, you know get a little overdrive on there, get a little bigger. Um, so it's the same chord. We start with the E flat major seven sus two. So we got the four six and the threes, muted A. And with this, it's more just kind of a one two three, one two one two three one two. <laughs> Okay, then we zoom up to our G sus minor here. We start with the G minor actually, so we'll have our 13 on the, the A there with the eight and, and 10 ready to go. And like I said, if that 13 is too much for you, you can just hit the eight on the uh, D instead and just kind of make a power chord with the 10 on the A. You can do that. Or you can do the, I, I'll do the stretch. I like the stretch. And it's just basically, uh, the 8, 10, 13, twice, to the 12. And then we do a little back and forth. We go 12, 13, 12. Right, repeat the initial section. Okay, we do our G minor, the 13s, to 12. But now we threw a new, new little thing in there where we come up to the 13 on the D now. All right, keeping the 8 and 10 with it, you can mute the A, and it's 13, 13, 12. 
for the chorus. This is where we really get to take advantage of our, our seven string action here, get to drop it low. Um, we just do a G sharp power chord at the four on the E, six on the A and D, and it's just one, two, three. Do that twice. Now we get to drop it to the low C, so we'll be at the first fret here. And we do a C minor to C sus two, so basically we just need to do the the one B three on the E and A and have the one on the D. And with that, it's just one, two, and then we just lift off of that one of the D to make it a, a sus two, keeping the one, three, three with it. And the, the second part of it is we do the open, one, open. All right, and then just repeat the, that section. And then uh, the ending of the chorus is we just land on that uh, C minor and just hold it. And for this bridge section, you know, that's the, kind of the big uh, spacey, you know, where the, the crazy vocals and all that stuff come in. Um, it's, it's just two chords going back and forth. And it's basically the G minor. All right, so we'll, we'll just do three on the E, five on the A and D, three on the G. And we just hit it, let it ring a couple measures, and then we just land on our C minor at the one B, three E and A, one on the D. And we just go back between those two chords just like that. <laughs> 